Every proposition is seductive at night. But how will your figures stand up to the light of day? It's death. How much, Nicole? You of all people should know, dear Stefan. You can't hit a jackpot without putting down a few chips. No way. <laughs> What was the nature of this research? I told you. We were investigating anthrax and smallpox to come up with antidotes that could be used in the field in the case of a biological attack. And there was no way to militarize them? To turn them into weapons instead of cures? No. No? So why are these documents in code? I told you. I was working at home. What is the password for the USB drive? Tell me the key to crack the code! Stop! Stop! I'll tell you. Thank you. Get them out of here! Package secure. Get the office. What happened? They've closed the casino. Get to the car. Bring it around to the front. What are you going to do? I'll see if I can tip the odds in our favor.
James, I've got the car in front of the casino. Where are you? I'm on my way. Get ready to move. See if this is dry enough for you. What are you drinking? Same thing. Straight. I was never one for girly drinks. Bond, are you there? Yes, Em. Right here. Nicole, do you mind if 007 and I speak privately for a moment? This is a need to know. Of course. No problem. We can talk. What did you find out? We've translated all the documents you photographed in Pomarov's office this afternoon. It appears that most of them were invoices for highly sophisticated chemical manufacturing equipment. They were to be delivered to a defunct chemical refinery he's recently brought back online in Siberia. It makes perfect sense. They tortured Tedworth, the researcher, for the code to his bio-research formulas. He was working on anthrax and smallpox antidotes for troops in the field but they could just as easily be weaponized. That's what we're afraid of. No, that's what the whole world is afraid of. You've got to get there. Confirm what we think he's up to and stop him. Perhaps Miss Hunter can help you facilitate this. Yes, I'll talk to her. Good. Good luck, 007. You finished? I have to take a look at Pomerov's refinery in Siberia. Em thought you might be able to help facilitate things. I'm gonna need a flight ground transportation, a local contact, and... Wait, wait, not so fast. I told Pomrov I'd get back to him about his business proposal. So it's the perfect cover to get the two of us into the refinery. The two of us? M said facilitate, not the company. Well, how do you think I'm going to get you to Siberia? Oh, let me guess. A friend of yours owns a plane? May I speak with Rudolph, please? Why am I not surprised? <laughs> You're going to love it. It's got a shower a wine cellar, and the most unbelievable circular bed. Yes, I'll hold. What? What's that look for? You'll be enjoying all that stuff alone. I'll be in the cockpit flying the plane. 